We get many students who are asking about how to study in Tsinghua University. In this video, I'm going to introduce seven tips on how you can get into Tsinghua University. So first I want to introduce a bit more about Tsinghua University and what it's like to study there. Tsinghua is the top university in China, joint top with Peking University. It's a really amazing place to study. It's got a really beautiful campus, which I've been to many times, and it's also got some of the smartest students in all of China. If you study there, you're going to be surrounded by the top students in China, which is an amazing experience. In terms of the programs at Tsinghua University, there are many different kinds of programs. It's a fully comprehensive university. There are Chinese language programs, there are batch those programs, masters and PhD. Firstly, I'll start with the Chinese language programs. There are a few different types of programs. The main ones is the semester or one year long Chinese programs at Tsinghua University. You can check some more information about this in the link below. Normally there's about two to 400 students studying there every year on this program. There's also an inter-university program, which is a very intensive, more expensive program. In this program, you will only be allowed to speak Chinese. You can learn Chinese very fast. I really recommend this program. I know a lot of students have studied there. Price is a bit higher. You can also find more information about that in the description. In terms of bachelor's programs, there are not many programs in English. Mostly they're all in Chinese. There's a couple of programs that are joint programs in English for bachelor's programs, such as the Chinese University of Hong Kong and Tsinghua University. There's a program there. And there's also lots of master's programs that you can study in English. And there are also some PhD programs as well. Definitely check out the summer programs because these are really popular, these programs. So I really recommend checking those out. Also, a lot of people ask for scholarships and there are lots of different types of scholarships at Tsinghua. There's the Chinese Scholarship Council scholarship. Each school has different scholarships for students. Normally they will give them to the best students. And then there's also some Beijing city scholarships. So the scholarships that are available depends on which program it is. And so you can find out more information about that in the description. So for example, some of the programs that are more expensive, they're not able to get a Chinese Scholarship Council scholarship for, such as some of the master's programs that are more expensive. But they do have some scholarships that are given given by the school for top students. So if you have top grades and you're interested in studying Tsinghua, there could also be opportunities for scholarships. And we know of lots of students who we've helped or who have got scholarships at Tsinghua. They also have these scholarships in China, not just in Tsinghua, where every year they will give scholarships to the top students who get the best grades each year. So for example, the top 5% of students may get some kind of full scholarships, incentive for the students to do well in school. Here are some tips on how you can get into Tsinghua. Number one, start applying early. The earlier you apply, the better because sometimes as soon as the admissions open they will start looking at the applications so if you want to increase your chances it's definitely better to apply as soon as possible so that they can just start reviewing your application earlier sometimes they will just give you feedback a week after you've applied or even a few days after you've applied so it's really a good idea to apply as soon as possible it's really important to understand the culture of Tsinghua when you're applying that's because every university has their own culture and they're looking for certain types of students in Tsinghua you can find out about the culture of the university by reading their website by learning about Tsinghua. I can also give you a brief summary of the culture. They're a very strong engineering university. The culture is basically being very direct and being concise. When you're applying, you don't need to use lots of flowery language. It's better to get to the point. You don't need to be so kind of creative with lots of ideas. It's better to kind of be to the point, be more pragmatic about what it is you're trying to do. And then the third tip is basically you need to really understand what they require for each program. Every program is looking for slightly different things in the students. So you can learn more about what each program is looking for and that's really important to understand. My next tip, it's really important to reach out to staff and students at the university. This is so that you can understand the program better if it's the right choice for you. It can also give you some inside information about the program and can help you with your application and it's also good for them if they know who you are before you apply and also they can reach out to you if there are any problems or if they need anything else. So it's always a good idea to reach out to staff and to students to make connections. Another tip is it's a really good idea to ask someone to help you with your application. It can be really Really helpful to have someone to review your essays and also to practice the interview with you. This could be a former student or it could be some application consultant or it could be just someone who studied at Tsinghua. It's a really good idea to try and get this help when you're applying because it can just make things easier. As a foreign student you don't know how it works in China so it's really good to get some more support on your application. And then the last tip is that you can contact us for a free call. We can give you advice, we can give you a proposal about how we can help and introduce our services and how we can help you to apply to Tsinghua. So if you have any questions let me know in the description and also you can check out some of our other videos. Thank you very much and best of luck in the future.